So I've been creating these paintings on spheres recently um, and actually one of these balls is very little use for making one of these paintings because the thing about this is it, it takes it about 180 degrees of the room um, and uh, whichever way you turn it, it takes it in a slightly different uh, way actually. Um, whereas this is sort of actually static in a sense. The image is static, although it's on a curved surface. It appears to move as it kind of goes past you. Everything sort of bends in and out of perspective. But in this case, it really does move. Um, you can't see more than 180 degrees at once. So this is quite different. People assume that this is the way that that is made. It's not. It's a painting on a, a spherical canvas of Muspole Workshops, which is where my studio is based. Um, and it is meant to exhibit a sort of infinitely uh, shifting perspective, uh, an inverted view of everything that you would see at a certain point. Um, and uh, that means that the perspective is constantly bending so that you always face on to the bit you're looking at. Um, and it's as if you're stood on the, a staircase and you can, if this thing spins around, see up the stairs towards the top of the staircase and down the stairs to the floor below um, and uh, it took several months to paint um, it's part of this series called Infinite Perspectives which is meant to I, I thought it would be nice to make paintings that reflected more of the way that we really see um, and something of so in a sort of uncanny way and um, the, these paintings are meant to do that. One of the challenges with them is thinking about the paintings as a composition um, when there is no sort of static element to the painting. You can never see the painting all at once so somehow you need to think about how, how to get kind of vistas within the painting um, without uh, having a static viewpoint and that, those are the things that excite me about this piece because in a sense I think it's sort of a, a radical uh, approach for realist painting um, and realist painting is sort of inherently uh, the opposite of a sort of a radical art form but actually to create um, something which has uh, no uh, fixed composition and um, it, no fixed perspective and no um, isn't a flat surface, is, a, is, is kind of halfway between a sculpture and a painting, is, is to some extent radical. I teach life drawing and I'm very aware of the realities of the way that we see and perhaps the inadequacies of like a flat painting in terms of representing the fact that we see this kind of combination of viewpoints. Um, I also have a sort of interest in, in teaching perspective but also uh, the carnivalesque and um, sort of circus mirrors and curiosities and the uncanny and sort of trying to present the extraordinary. Um, often finding the extraordinary within the everyday and these, these are a lot about that.